Hello, it's Pastor Keith, and it is morning prayer for Tuesday, December 5th, 2023. I don't think I've said it for a couple times. I can't remember, but uh, yeah, we're still in Mililani and uh, still Christ Lutheran Church, and that's a good thing. This is from uh, the book of the prophet Micah, and it's the fourth chapter, the first five verses for today. Some familiar readings will be coming up here in the next couple of weeks. But in this one, Micah 4, 1 to 5, In the days to come, the mountain of the Lord's house shall be established as the highest of the mountains, and shall be raised up above the hills. Peoples shall stream to it, and many nations shall come and say, Come, let us go up to the mountain of the Lord, to the house of the God of Jacob, that he may teach us his ways, that we may walk in his paths. For out of Zion shall go forth instruction, and the word of the Lord from Jerusalem. He shall judge between many peoples, and shall arbitrate between strong nations far away. They shall beat their swords into plowshares, and their spears into pruning hooks. Nation shall not lift up sword against nation, neither shall they learn war any more. But they shall all sit under their own vines and under their own fig trees, and no one shall make them afraid, for the mouth of the Lord has spoken. For all the peoples walk each in the name of its God, but we will walk in the name of the Lord our God forever and ever. So they're going to beat their swords into plowshares and their spears into pruning hooks. Would that we could do that together here in this day and age. I despair at times about that, but we persist. And we pray for the human family. A pule, kako. O oh God, you made us in your own image and redeemed us through Jesus, your son. Look with compassion on the whole human family. Take away the arrogance and hatred that infect our hearts. Break down the walls that separate us. Unite us in bonds of love. And through our struggle and confusion, work to accomplish your purposes on earth so that in your good time, every people and nation may serve you in harmony around your heavenly throne. Through Jesus Christ, our Savior and Lord. Amen. Keep praying for peace, brothers and sisters, siblings in Christ. We uh, need peace in our hearts, peace in our families, peace in our churches and temples and mosques and synagogues. We need peace in our nations. So, may the God of all peace, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit protect you, guide you, and lead you with wisdom throughout this day and always. Amen.